Good morning, afternoon, and evening, everyone. This is Hip Tesla. Welcome to episode 3 of Blood Omen 2 Legacy of Cain series. We're here. Finally. I don't know why I'm saying that. It's not like we expected something. Hey, sis, welcome to the stream. <laughs> hey, Sash. You're now a Sash. I'm a belt, she's a Sash. <laughs> Let's get into this. We're looking for that goddamn bishop. Can I even say goddamn bishop? Yeah, it's well, made up it's religion. Kind of, it's kind of to the point. <laughs> uh, here we go. We at least we have checkpoints. I love that. I'm gonna I'm gonna be cocking around this town. If that's a word. Oh, they're talking. Yes, you do. I've seen you there. I've left this employer just this minute. I wouldn't go near the place if I were you. Why not? I've got this wine. Seraphim searching the house. Thanks, friend. I owe you for that. I heard. I hear like every fifth word. That's how low the volume. Was. What was the audio engineer doing? Like, was he high when he was working on this Probably. game? It's like, huh, totally, dude. I I know what they're saying in his head. They're saying something completely different. I want to go mist before they can see. You get away from me. I was here first. Didn't rest your eyes for just a minute? No, I swear to you. Because Where? the bishop succeeds in escaping. I was here every minute. He did not get out this way. Have you found the tunnel yet? Ah, you believe that rumor? That the bishop had a tunnel? If he didn't get out this way, and the others didn't see him, then there must be a tunnel. It stands to reason. If there is, we'll find it. Just as we'll find whoever told the bishop we were coming. Knew it then? Of course he knew. Why else would he have slipped away like he did, idiot? Prepare to die. Well, at least I killed one of them. Yeah. Ah, oh, damn it! I wanted to dodge that. That was janky. 
Let's get that sword. Come on. The other one. Oh, that was... Okay. Oh, I could have totally dodged that. Get up, Kane. It's a bad camera angle. Wrong people. Why would you target some guys like a kilometer away? You gotta focus on these battles like there's something. Ugh. God. Really, you are, love? I didn't even check the internet. We were outside most of the day. It should, could just be Twitch. God, I... Yeah. I really miss Mixer. Remember Mixer? How everything worked? I don't remember it working. Why? I don't remember it. <laughs> That's where we started. We first streamed on Mixer. When we had those raffles, remember? Small streamer raffles. Then you would like put a vote for me. Then like 30 people come in. And I'm like, holy shit, what do I do? Just pretend they're not there. Nobody will notice you. <laughs> and you'd be like, they're people. <laughs> it could be just Twitch. It's normal with Twitch, unfortunately. It's the biggest streaming service and it's not the best. Maybe it's just the burden of, you know, being the biggest. Servicing millions of people at the same time. So those Seraphax actually gave us a clue before I ended their lives. Man, I know you're supposed to lose some life constantly, but in this game it's just abysmal. Look, I'm already missing a good chunk of my health. Just for existing. How dare I? Okay, there's a ladder there I can climb. I wonder if there's anything here. Leave me alone. What do you mean, old tabs? <laughs> Are you messing with her? Close old tabs. What? Those crickets? Again? Leave me alone. I think they're in the bushes. Can I eat crickets? They're supposed to be full of pro protein. Okay, up the ladder we go. Ooh, that's a nice bench. Imagine sitting here sipping on wine on this, like, 19th century balcony. It'll work just like King work. I, I'm not sure if you're... You gotta clarify now if you're messing with her, because what tabs? The, the Twitch app has no tabs. You can barely runs one stream, let alone more. More. Oh, look at the stained glass, love. Yeah. What is? What does this represent? So it's. They're all kind of the same. There's a broken window. How convenient. Like in the browser? Do you mean close all apps? Is that what you mean? Yeah. yeah okay. I gotta, I gotta ask for clarification. Otherwise, I could, I could understand something completely different. Ah, look at my long jump! Hua! That's my long jump sound effect. <laughs> we got a raid chopper from Sexy Weski. Hello, Weski. Welcome, raiders. Welcome. <laughs> Good to see you, Weski. How are you doing? Oh. It's like, oh, you sweet, sweet man. <laughs> you sweet, sweet man. Thank you. That's <laughs> like double, double the, um, hello, hello. 
uh, showering with me with, with double stuff. Uh, I gotta give him a proper Prof. Wesker Cho. One, two, three, four. Here we go. Aha, this time it should work. Yes, it works. Detroit become human. Ha, huh, I've heard of that game. Was it any good? Did you did you enjoy it? Where uh, I was expecting to see resistance there. But yeah, people check out Sexy Wesky over here or Professor Wesker Cho 1234. He does uh he plays very similar games. Uh retro retro stuff, classics, uh very fun person to be around and uh and <laughs> watch his stream. He's hilarious and kind hearted and that's why I love him. Enjoyed? Okay. It was good. I just heard about its name, but uh, I don't know anything about the game. I've seen jokes about it, like Detroit. What was Detroit? Uh, Become Human? Yeah. And then there's like the other game by Silicon Knights called Too Human. And I don't know what was the third one. So somebody on Twitter made like uh, a compilation, <laughs> a series. <laughs> Detroit become human than something than too human. Oh my god, you went to the other side. Looks like movie. Is that a is that a David Cage game? When you say it looks like a movie, that's the first thing that pops into my head. I love games that look like movies. Usually they have good stories. Oh, can I can I sneak up on him? Yeah, stupid Seraphan. Wow, I got a double combo on him. Thank you for the blood. Please donate to the Bank of Cain. Story maybe will be good. You're not sure yet. Well, as long as you enjoyed it, that's good. I can take your recommendation. We usually agree in tastes. We both think that the original Resident Evil 2 and 3 are better than the remake. So, <laughs> that's a big plus in my book right away. <sighs> What else do we have here? Just books? Somebody somebody's threw knowledge around. Is this door open? Oh, it opens. The big door. I wish I could read these di... <coughs> Pardon me. <clears throat> I wish I could read these diaries. They have... They probably have some useful info in them. Well, we'll never know. Because Kane doesn't want to fucking read. He wants to slaughter. I gotta drink more blood from this innocent person. Drink straight from their chest. Don't even... Don't do anything. Just... Oh, there was a checkpoint. Cool. I didn't even see the checkpoint. Just massacred everyone. That's the door. A mirror. What door? <laughs> door? What door? Okay. That guy didn't even get to... Yes, a brand new sword. Cool, okay. Next, please. Let's try to go mist. If I can trick him, that would be very nice. Oh, they can't even open the door, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thanks for the hydrate, sis. I have tea to hydrate tonight. Mmm, peppermint. Ah, lovely. <laughs> door? <laughs> what door? <laughs> I love that. It's not an ad lib. It's... Ah, let's go one on one, man. Oh, these guys can detect me. Hasha! Oh, that guy will see me because he's going straight for me. Or maybe not. He's gonna check the body, no? Quickly. Yeah! See, there, there are multiple animations. Now he stabbed him right through the back of the face. You gotta love how they just stand there to take it. Is there more of them there down there? Yeah, if I could somehow get him up here. Let's drink this guy's blood straight from his spine, no less. Okay. That's two Seraphax less to kill. Hard way. Maybe I can lure him upstairs, or or just go rage fury on him. Can I sneak? That works. Why not? 
Wow, these aren't as nearly as scary as the ones outside. Cool! Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> I love how he extends his hand like when he's drinking. Doing <laughs> like in Bugs Bunny. You know, the Oprah one. <laughs> Me, 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 me. <laughs> There's a door here. What door? Hello? Is there a coffin? A dining room. Kane, see if you can find any other clues. I'll be examining this. <laughs> oh, you can't even open the door. I can't open the door! Okay. Fireplace, no map on the fireplace. Huh. Oh, is it boss battle? I didn't explore the rest of the house. Damn it, I hate that. Oh, it's the Seraphim asshole. Put that weapon away. Put the weapon away. You put the weapon away, boy. Yeah. Ow. Wow, he just took me down. This is like, what, a heavy guy? Is he dead? Wow, I thought he was gonna be a lot harder. With that intro and everything. He fucking smashed through the door. Should I take his weapon? Look at this, Sash. What is this? Holy fuck, what the hell is this? I love it. Sir? No, okay, I'm not... Oh. You there. What's your business here? Who are you? I beg you, be merciful, good sir. I am... I was butler to the Bishop of Meridian, but the, the, the Seraphim, they're, they're inside now. I, I, I thought I would wait here. Where are they? They accuse the Bishop of aiding the vampire resistance. They're looking for proof. I beg of you, do not tell them where to find me. I will do anything. Yes, you will. <laughs> tell me where to find the Bishop. I can't. I, I, I mean, I don't know. Shall I ease your mind and tell you I am sent by Vorador for the vampire resistance? Or shall I simply tear out your throat and continue my search? I leave the decision to you. The cathedral. He fled there. He thought he would be safe. Okay, he's alive. The ground will not deter his pursuer. Where is the cathedral? To the northeast. But it will do you no good. You cannot enter without the proper authority. I suggest you show me the way, now. Of course, sir. This way, sir. It is my pleasure to serve you. This tunnel will bring you again to the streets. I thank you. Good night. I like how he alters between <laughs> between scared shitless and just like sharing information. <laughs> okay, now I will tell you this. <laughs> <laughs> Where did that guy come from? Was he waiting in the closet to jump out? <laughs> waiting for someone suspicious to get in? Ah, oh, I'm closed. I didn't even check the rest of the house. Curse you, game. Curse you. I don't like being cock-blocked from exploration. Maybe there was a chest there? We'll never know. That's... That's not fun. You can't just... Cut off exploration. The next level? No, it's still the same level, I think. I could go back one checkpoint, but fuck it. Not worth it. So, where did the tunnel get me out of? Did I just jump out of the ground? Some context would be very... Very, very, very... Uh, loved. Was that a flying person in the sky? Did you see that? Yep, look, look. Oh, those are birds. Never mind. I thought they were flying vampires. That one window is suspicious, though. I wonder if I can just climb somehow. Nope. Ah. Shit I have to deal with. Oh, there's a Seraphic over there. He's next to the water. Water is my enemy. Look, it's the glowing assholes. Oh, what the fuck? You did the fourth hit. You want to do a fourth hit on me, boy? So if you time it right, you can actually... Like, if you time... Uh, it seems that 
while they're getting up if you hit at the right time they won't hit they won't block it which would be cool if it's true nothing there Dodge is really cool. Yep. I wish I had more of these weapons, whatever they're called. Silently in the corner, I drank his blood. And then immediately I lost some hell because why not? <laughs> like vampires are weak as shit. How the fuck? Do they even rule this land of Nazgoth? Oh, look at the cathedral in the moonlight. It's like Castlevania. <laughs> we're we're going into a better game. Do you see that, love? Yep. What, what is going on? Why is there... Oh, okay. As we approach, we can actually see. Cool. It's not just background. That monument is weirdly crooked. Nope, okay. Nothing here. Oh, is there fog? No, just priests. I can only hope he was bad. Oh, look at that guy blocking and shit. Thank you. So that guy definitely blocked as he was getting up, but I might have uh, missed the timing. That's also a possibility. Does anybody does anybody take care of this cemetery? Ah, here we go. Anything here? Nope. I can't open the door! Even that's simplified compared to the first game, where remember how you could fuck up and not be able to drink their blood? Okay, turn around, boy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, sweet, Sean. He's. Did you just kick him to check if... Okay, I can't go there. What the fuck is going on? Game, you you hella broken. Look, 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 he's stuck. He was stuck in him. Did you see that? Yeah. Uh, there again. <laughs> oh my god, that's embarrassing. It's like he's playing on his corpse. But... Playing hopscotch on your comrade's corpse is not sexy, man. It's not sexy at all. Come back here, come on. I wanna I wanna finish you. Oh no, that, that guy's stuck. Where did he go? Is he scared? Oh, off with his head. I love that one. That one's pretty cool. All right, need some blood. These guys give me actually a decent amount of XP. I can't get over that fucking sound, like slurping through a straw. I can't even make it. You got you. You need something. You need a bottle or a glass with liquid to make that sound. <laughs> What is up with the cemetery that's like everything's concrete? That's definitely concrete. Where how do you bury the dead? You have to de like demolish yes. it every time. <laughs> you have to fucking demolish for each one of them and how did you like look this there's no there's no rhyme or reason to this. 
big, small, big, small. That's, that's okay. But then we have... That you can't fit a human here. Look. Between these two. You can't fit, like... Maybe they just, like, chop them up in pieces. I have so many questions. This weapon is good. I want to know what this is. Because I like it. Nope. Let's move on. There's nothing in this area. So I need to get to the cathedral, which is looming above me, I'm gonna say. Yep. Probably have to go, get, go around and find the key. Oh, there he is. Hello there, sir. Oh, there's two of them. Hold on. One of them dies in the moonlight. The other one, maybe not to die. Why are you following each other? Like, choose your own path. Ah, shit. Oh. You had to move, you asshole. Alright. My glaive or whatever it is is almost done. I like how this fog is selectively on the streets. Okay. Okay, I can trick him now. Just gotta get behind him. Unlike that other guy. Because they're doing some weird laps here. There we go. He's gonna go over and kick him, isn't he? Oh no, he's doing the thing. While you do that, I'm just gonna play with your head. I mean, it could be, but there's like 50 of them. How many marks do you need? You could just get one big one and write all the names on it. Not clutter the like valuable real estate space with 50 of them. That's just what I think. Let's take this stuff or whatever it is. Uh, these are definitely graves. Like, um, what are they called? Crypts. Even. That's a crypt. So, and this is a cemetery. I don't. I doubt they're marks. It's just bad programming. Bad, bad planning even. Look, here I can imagine someone being buried. It's grass and all that. But like here on concrete, I highly, highly doubt it. Why am I looking for logic here? It's Blood Omen 2. Just fucking enjoy it. <gasps> it's the blue balls. And I don't have... Wait, I'm gonna try now. I'm gonna sacrifice the glaive if necessary so it's red if i take the blue balls now oh no it's just xp never mind i've been blue balled by blue balls okay i was hoping it's the weapon boost one because i wanted to see if it repairs the weapon or just makes it stronger i'm not sure and i forgot to download the manual to confirm that, so hold on a second. Can we enter that? Hello? I I can see it's slightly open. Never mind. Hello? Is this where Raziel was uh, buried? Do I need a password for this? Look. I pressed it. What is this symbol? That's Kane? No. Why is my why is my symbol on the I can't open the door? This one? That's the same one, yep. What the fuck? I have my own crypt? It's gonna turn out to be my initial grave from Blood Omen 1. Who made this and how? And why is my... Is this my grave? Is this where I was buried? Yeah, it's a good question. That thinking about it. Blood Omen 1. So, 
Cain was killed in front of a tavern. Who buried him? Just, just villagers were like, oh, I guess we should bury him. Yeah, but he had like a fancy crypt and all that. I know he was a noble man. But that, you know, maybe I'm asking too much, many questions. Yeah. Uh, just for, for a series that explains so much, it also explains very little. I'm gonna fuck around with you, boy. Shaboom! That had to hurt. Oh, wow, that killed him instantly. Nice! They never talk about it. He should have had family. Like I said, he was a nobleman. Wealthy. Because at the start of the first game, he's traveling Nosgoth. And then he gets killed in front of the tavern. But, you know, it was planned. Remember, he was planned to be the guardian of balance from birth. Uh, like the moment Ariel died, he was born. Uh, and pillars choose their guardians. At birth. Yeah. I'm <laughs> Thanks, love. And also, just by... What is here? Maybe it's going to be the next level. This is closed. I I'm not sure if they choose guardians. Like if they just choose people who were born at the moment the previous guardians died. Or what yeah. what happened. But uh, we do know that pillars were made by vampires. The real vampires. The ancients. And all the guardians were vampires until they were destroyed. Killed. Some of them also killed Others. Kala, Kalakua. Kalakua. Hello, Kalakua. Is there someone I know with a different name? Or I'm here. <laughs> Glad you're here. Welcome to the stream. And so on. Unless you're Kane. Are you Kane? Can you tell us what happened to your grave? How, how, where, how did you end up there? How did you get... How did you get out of the grave? Oh, Bishop. Greetings, old man. I assume that I address the Bishop of Meridian. <laughs> what? I seek information on gaining access to the Sarafan Key. You are to give me passage inside. I am sent by Vorador. <laughs> oh, he's dying, isn't he? What ails you? Speak. He speaks only at my command. What? You are too late, Kay. He is entirely in my power. Release him and I may spare your life. I hold the cards now, Kay. Surrender yourself to me, or I will kill him. What do I care for the life of some mortal? But the thought of killing you at last entices me. Tell me, Marcus. Do you truly believe you can stop me? Stay back. You cannot win. The bishop will tell you nothing while he remains under my power, and you will never catch me. No, oh, he's not dead. We can't have his blood. Okay, so we have to catch him. I swear these guys are just measuring their willies. He just said you cannot catch me. He said that, but still. Hide. You wait long enough and you get so bored that you just have to get out of here. <laughs> there, yeah. <laughs> I meant like at the start of Blood Omen 1, because you just appear outside your grave, which is upright. Did he toss and turn inside? I never thought about it until I just questioned it. <laughs> but yeah, as I was saying, uh, the ancients made the pillars, and Janos was the last of them, you know, the blue-skinned, winged creatures, divine ones, before they were afflicted with the blood curse. Ah! Bloodlust? Is that what they call it? 
a blood curse, blood, blood whatever. Before I had to, had they, before they had to drink blood to sustain themselves. And it's, I don't know, because they couldn't procreate, they became sterile. Uh, there were no more new vampires, and Pillar started choosing people, like humans, as their guardians. Do I have to, like, chase him around, or... Is that a soldier? Or do I want to listen in? Oh, yeah. Are you, are you familiar with the story, or, or is... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I... Very much. I love this series. It's just Blood Omen 2 is ridiculous, but, like... I love the first game. That's the old. That's the last one I played. Actually, I just beat it uh, like two weeks ago. But uh, the first Solar beat, first Soul Reaver beat it two times, three, four times in total, and second Soul Reaver twice, and Defiance once. So Defiance comes after this. So yeah, you know some of the lore to explain, but feel like it could be spoiled. Yeah, I know the whole games. Don't worry about that. I'm just like I. I know it's Blood Omen 2, but don't run. <laughs> it's just... I like to ask these questions sometimes to dick around and sometimes really interested in what's going on. <laughs> like, why is this like this? So, in a series where some things are over-explained, when you think about it, some elementary things are n not explained enough. Did he wait for me behind the corner? It's just Blood Omen 2. I don't know. <laughs> it's silly. After we had like Soul Reaver 1 being so epic and then Soul Reaver 2 being, well, story epic at least, we can give it that. And we have Blood Omen 2, the, the running, chasing simulator. At least you can jump. They didn't take that away. Sash, this isn't your favorite game, right? <laughs> <laughs> It is interesting when other people are playing it. Are we entering? Oh, we have to pull the switch. Like, did he not lock himself inside? Uh, maybe I should have drank blood of one of those... Um, villagers? I know my wife and sister wouldn't allow it, but... Come on, just grab the fucking ladder, man! <laughs> Some king of vampires. Loop. Am I... Okay, we can run there. What about here? Oh, I thought there was something there. There's nothing. This game I also beat only once, but it's just because it's Blood Omen 2. Exactly. Yeah, that's the, that's the feeling I got. I actually was dreading starting this, because I remember. So I played them in order. Soul Reaver 1, Blood Omen 2. Uh, then uh, Soul River 2, then Defiance. I couldn't play Blood Omen, the original, until recently when it was re-released on GOG, and I got that Verox patch that makes the game mwah, beautiful and easy to play. So that's why I beat it for the first time now. But I watched Blood Omen 1 before playing Soul River 1 and and you know the rest. So I thought it goes, you know, Blood Omen, Soul River, Blood Omen, Soul River, Defiance. <laughs> but it actually goes Blood Omen, Soul River, Soul River, Blood Omen, Defiance. And because I knew Soul River 2, Sasha, my lovely wife, told me that that one's gonna blow my mind with the story. I couldn't wait to get to it. So between the first Soul River and second Soul River, this felt like a letdown. But now, like, playing it again since... When did I play it? This? 2015? So like seven years later, playing it again, it's much better than I remember. It's janky and broken in many regards, but... What? It's not Soul Reaver 2. I can talk trash about this one. Just look, what the fuck was that? The animations. I know it's a different team and everything, but you could have at least co copied work of the other team. You know, just see what they're doing. Try to do it something similar. Whee! Do we have a checkpoint? Yeah. That means he's gonna kill me like 10 times. Let's go, Fury. I wish I had a better weapon. Can't push this. A very... <laughs> oh, here we go. 
You fucking idiots! Both of you. You are too busy. M <laughs> yeah, it is. It's fun. It's funny and fun. I'm not gonna lie. It's not horrible. I played many worse. So what am I supposed to do? Defend myself? He's gonna run around and try. Oh, it's a boss battle. Okay. Do I need to do this? I think this is gonna make him reveal himself. Yeah. Okay, so I have to ring the bells to make him appear. Oh, he hates sound. Cool. Finally did some damage to the guy. So we're just gonna do this. At least in the first phase of the battle. Alright. Uh, like I said, I played many worse, way worse PS2 games, so this isn't that bad, it just... Just because it's surrounded by way better games, it feels way worse, but it's not that bad, it's very fun to play. It's very playable. Each boss has a different approach. This one, this guy obviously hates sound. So that's how I'm going to defeat him, huh? Is he going to break these? Because I would expect him to do that. Like, stop with the fucking bells! <laughs> for for all their... For all their uh, cock measuring, he just can't stand loud sounds. That's kind of funny. Oh, yep, there's gonna be a second phase. He tried to grab me <laughs> during the cutscene. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> you know it! Oh, he's gonna mind control others to do that for him. So I have to get them now? What? They have. He just went deaf, didn't he? So we gotta find something else. So all the bosses seem to have like the 50%. Yeah, that can't be used anymore. It's... Oh wait, that one's glinting. Do I need to pull the swords out? Is that it? Nope. He's running around invisible. We gotta find a different way to get to him. I would think I have to cut something. Look, it's glinting from a distance, but when you approach it, there's nothing. Trying to cheat on me, game? Look. You see that? See now? Is it broken? Is there something behind? Maybe I need to strike it with a sword? I'll try. Nope. Just jerking me around. Alright. Then there has to be something else. What, did he escape? Oh, I have to go upstairs. Okay. All the while losing health. So I need to kill these bastards. One more time, come on. Actually, I should fill up the rage bar on them. Ah, did he just... Ah, oh, come on. Now I don't have a weapon. Ah, oh, you bitch. What a fucker. Did you see that? Just approached from the behind. I didn't... I was like, how is the guy hitting me from... Well, I'm not even there, but... So I have to fight them and him. You know what? I'm gonna kill you twice now for that. That's such a douche move. Q. 
can always be glad when he stops right there. Just running like a headless fly. Darn those bells. Slap him like a bitch. <laughs> Literally what I'm doing, I'm just using my hands now. Because the game removes your weapon at the checkpoint. <laughs> oh, that's wonderful. Literally saved by the bell. You just gotta give him a few seconds and he'll just run into you. Oh, I gotta set the alarm for the IP switch. Yeah, I'll just... I shouldn't... He says my errs! <laughs> Here we go, we're already there, nice. Because he's using mind control, I think, sis. That's why their heads are glowing. Well, I'll be right there. So they go there, they fucked that up. Yeah, I have to go after them. Like a year ago, I decided to give try a speedrunning defiance, and I found out it's quite easy to do. One of my favorite games of all time. I've beaten it in like half an hour? How? So what? You can skip cutscenes in defiance? Because I only played that one once. Because there's no way you can. It's, it's a huge yeah, game, <laughs> but uh, without the cutscenes, yeah, I can imagine that happening. Sure Skip like seventy-five percent of the chapters. Oh, you mean like, like glitch assisted, or can you skip? I forgot how it works. I remember it goes Kane Raziel, Kane Raziel, uh, and it's like Devil May Cry gameplay. Let me set that alarm so I don't forget and. 1959 alarm one for 2159 as well there we go oh i love how i fixed that green screen so don't turn my back to him now he'll try to follow me and beat me up oh okay Don't let the guy run up to my back. You dead, bro? Alright, where's the other one? What, the corpses? I don't know. Most levels have more than one chapter... Chapter end loaded, so if I can get to where I'm not supposed to be, I can skip most of the game. That's what I thought, yeah, that's what I thought. That that sounds plausible, yeah. <laughs> Think you can Watch out. The other guy is shooting as well. So keep out of line of sight. Ow! I'm gonna drink your blood satisfyingly. What the fuck, is that guy tall or is he just flying? Oh, I'm beating the boss and the guy at the same time, look at that. They're not that hard. Come on, drink his blood. Glitchy mess. So does that mean they've, they we fixed the bells? You have to do it manually. Oh, there's more of them. So I have to fight him while I'm fighting them. Okay, so they'll just be my feeding stations. Kick him in the nuts. Yeah. Uh. Poor priest. They're just being mind control. I have to find him. 
I should block and get my thing up, so let's use one of them for that. Oh god, game, don't embarrass yourself. <laughs> Can I hit the bells? He would hate that. Wow, you're supposed to be a ranger? I don't know, definitely not me. He is. Oh, there we go, finally. Okay, full rage bar. Let's go. Nope, I can't. I saw that right away, but I want to find that guy and drink his blood. Yes, as a matter of fact, I do. Okay, I need that rage bar for him. Kick him in the nuts. Ah. Alright, so I can restore health, that's cool. I can't let him... There you go, bitch slap! Just keep bitch slapping him. Use the guys. F yeah, I'm gonna use these guys for that. Yeah. That's okay. I don't. As long as as soon as I'm red. So I have two corpses to drink. Now find Marcus. Marcus, let's measure willies. I know you like that. There he is. Yeah. <laughs> Richard. Terrible demons. Ouch. Stop in the name of the law. I'm not going to chase you all day, dude. I'm going to kill you at some point. Yeah, his blood is getting away. Okay, he's not as tough as I thought. One more time. Oh, he's left with one, like, glimmer of hair. So I just need to just run the opposite way and catch him. <laughs> the game is barely... It's not now! Oh my god, he really knows how to I'm hit sorry. the... Yeah. No, I didn't know where he, go, where he went. Again? How many thermostats do we have? Like, it's the thermostat factory over here. Oh, there he goes. I'm just hoping I'm behind him. I know he'll try to approach me first. There you go. He's dead. Jeez. <laughs> Had a good combo there. Yes, take his dark gift. Someone, someone did say for Soul Reaver 2 that it has Kingdom Hearts like graphics. Bishop. Yes, I do. I must thank you for destroying that fiend. He, he, he robbed me of my mind. 
He was a novice. Bishop, I require your help. Borador has sent me to gain passage to the Saraphan Keep. One of our associates is held captive there. A fool's errand to enter the very maw of the beast. But yes, I will help you. I will take you there. I will show you the entrance. His belly is like clipping it to itself. Alright, finally the next chapter. Whoo! Chapter 5. There's 11 chapters in total, so... Well done, Kay. You have entered the Seraphan Keep at last. Not without difficulty. I encountered another old friend on the way. Marcus. I see. Then may I assume that another of the Seraphan Lord's guardians have fallen? You may. Many times I attempted to persuade Marcus to join with us, but he would not heed me. My arguments were more convincing. I sense that Uma is being held in the uppermost reaches of the keep. You must hurry. She is to be executed soon. Where is the Seraphan Lord? Is he here? I do not know. His presence is masked from my senses. But you are no match for him yet, King. If you encounter him, hide. If he sees you, run. Run? Hide? Huh? Vorador, you do not know me. Your task is to find Uma quickly. Let nothing distract you. The information she obtained from the Industrial Quarter may allow us to defeat the Seraphan Lord at last. Do not destroy our only chance with hasty action. How sickened I have become with weary admonitions of safety and care. How I longed to rend the flesh of my one true enemy. How I thirsted for the taste of his life's blood on my lips. Okay, quickly. I will be watching. Word or sound not as dramatic and yeah. as, you know, smart. The moon is beautiful and like the the graphics are really kick ass. I really thought this game just because of this. It looks better than it looked when it was new. Yeah. I mean, this, I think this is what broke it for me. The moment I booted up and I saw this, I was like, what the fuck is this? 1985, trying to make a 3D game. Not moving legs and all, but look at this. I, this... I don't actually care about the legs not moving, but the story. Yeah, very simplified. So, oh, wait, there's a Seraphan there. So what do I have? Char. Oh, I want a stealth kill. Stealth kill, stealth, stealth kill. What you gonna do? What you gonna do when you go for stealth kill? Ha! Yeah! <laughs> Fatality! Wait, you gonna kill Tommy or Bart? I'm not sure. I don't try to question it. Yeah, I just follow the game. His throat. That's what I'm hey, I have, a, I have new clothing. I was naked. When did I... Yeah. When did I put on new clothes? Oh, when I met Vorador, probably. I didn't even notice. Real. <laughs> yeah, I was, I, was, I was just asking myself when, when that happened. So, yep. <laughs> Where is someone? You know, the Soul Reaver 1 and 2 tracks are not leaving my head for a few days now. In the first one, actually, the track that I never thought about as much, it's uh, one of the, those, like, one track. I can't remember where it's from, but I would re I, I could recognize it. And from Soul Reaver 2, it's the Seraphim Keep theme. Let's hear. <laughs> what do you want me to sing? What do you want me to do? Let me charm you, oh little man. How do I charm this asshole? Here we go. Why am I a jester? 
Can I do more for my Lord King? Oh, he left my influence. Inf influence of confluence. It's enough for the puzzles. Never mind me, little man. I'm just trying to do something here, obviously. That is death through the door. Can't do that shit with me, son. Greetings, everybody. What have I missed and how often did hippie did die? I only died like twice, my man. Welcome to the stream. They redeemed another sing mode and I gotta oblige. Redeemables, we'll discuss them tomorrow, my woman. I cannot sing and do the Arnold, those are two separate things. <gasps> Is that the chest? That's the chest of glory. I gotta get... I, Cause I need a better sword. For glory, gory glory. Oh, come on, game. Why are you so ass and fucky? Oh, I just I came know. out of there. Maybe I can charm that clown inside. Clown, please. No, I can't. Looks like this spider web. <laughs> Ch checker. Chest spider web. Spider. <laughs> spider oh, cane? Chest, spider chest, cane. Chest. No, oh, I think I need to do this, and that'll do the steam. That is what I, that is what I feel I need to do. But first, let me open the boost chest, the chest of balls. It's your purple balls, purple balls, go inside my sword, make it better, purple balls. Here we go, turn the valve. The vapor is gone. <laughs> uh. Yes. Holy. Holy crap. Oh, god damn you guy. I hate these Seraphan. They're so f fucking cheap. Oh, he missed somehow. Thank god. He missed and I stabbed him in the ass. Slurping his blood. Through armor of brass. Come on. What is next? Is this hot? Or is it me? Is this my destiny? Huh. There's more fart puzzles, but why? Why does everything run on cabbage fart magic? I don't know what ve Vechnaya Pamiat is. I have no idea. Gonna cook a bit, but still listening to the stream, so feel free to have extensive conversations. <laughs> Sure, man. I'm happy to see you. Sorry, I'm just lost here in the in Blood Omen 2. It is immersive. I didn't ever said it's not immersive. It's just janky as hell. How would you spell jank? J A N K Y. 
<laughs> not junky, janky. So there's a lever here, and there's a lever there. Do I want to use the crane to start this lever? That does nothing at all. Oh, there's... No. Nope. There we go. What am I grabbing? Am I gonna grab some coal? I grab nothing. Nothing at all. Oh wait, there's redstone. It looks like redstone. Is that open now? It's kinda leaking fire. So that that I want to where's leaking? That's redstone. Yeah, that's the that's the leaky pipe. So I'm gonna put this here to blow it up this barrel. And that's gonna solve the puzzle. I can bat my ass on it because fire leaked to the side. Here we go. That was easy. I want some challenge game, but not with stupid bosses. Rats. I don't care. I don't fucking care. I will sing my heart out. Oh. This one was. He had a sword. Thank God for my powerful sword. Stop, little man. I ain't gonna hurt you. I already ate for today. Red balls, red balls. Chugging on those red balls, red balls. Almost a level up. Fly, fly, Kane. You can do it, but you can't jump over a fucking human. Look at this. Look at this. You fucking kidding me? <laughs> Lay that pistol down, babe. Lay that pistol down. Oh. Pistol pack and mama. Lay that pistol down. Now oh, come here, bitch. Let me ask you a question or two. She kicked down my windshield. Lay that pistol down, babe. Lay that pistol down. Pistol, pistol pack, pack and mama. mama. Lay, Lay that pistol, pistol down. down. She kicked down my windshield. She hit me over the head. She cussed and cried and said I lied and wished that I was dead. You know, there, was two. there were two versions. Pistol and pistol. Yeah, pistol solo and pistol. Yeah, pistolo. Oh. <laughs> Why did that Seraphine kill kill that guy? What did what did he do? Hey Delmar, sorry, but <laughs> I'm just fucking lost to this game. <laughs> Welcome to the stream. Blood Omen still. No, uh um, Carter is cooking. Jesus. Okay, these guys can detect vampires like the other guy are you gonna he's gonna poke the air now trying to look for me but i ain't gonna be there boy i'm gonna be right behind you like this Hacha! uh do something better whenever it's powerful you saw like he they can cut heads off like go through them but if it's a powerful if you boost the sword it always cuts their bellies cuts them like pigs hee-haw there's fire. Wait, is that this 
that looks like a bat not like a yeah that looks like bat skin the bat hide yeah <laughs> you can't sing along to a solo there's no it's it's a solo for a reason sis <laughs> I love this. Look at this. Like you can't really, unless you just keep wooden crates next to it. But you can't start a fire here, oh outside. God, here. Having a bat? They have bat. a bat. <laughs> a bat, yeah. I mean, like this. You can just sit on this concrete and just take in the heat from the fire. Uh, they use the same ones for their beds, apparently. Okay, there's nothing here. Okay, the fart is running. Let's let's catch up to the fart. No, it's very it's much slower than we are. Look at it. <laughs> Please turn on the lights. Oh uh, yeah, they'll be done tomorrow morning. Uh, just wait for it. It'll arrive at some point. The 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 electricity. I mean I mean it's not electricity. It's glyph magic. Why why can't I just fucking kick the door open? I'm Kane, bitch. Shared your today's experience of kebab. Shared with whom? I did post it on Discord. Yeah. Oh, that no. The city is powered by ass. What is this? Kalakua. Kalakua, thanks for the follow, appreciate it. Hope you're enjoying the stream. Ah, I'm feeding here, bitch. Oh, is that the glowy asshole? Let's be careful. They fight dirty. They fight dirty like dirty Harry. Hey, senpai. Senpai, my friend. Do oh, you want to trick me, boy? I love these executions. These these are just worth playing the game for. What do you mean? Well, uh, last time you actually got its heart for Hold on, he's gonna scream. I'm not gonna get scared this time. I hope. No, he's not. Oh damn it! I shouldn't forget because next time that happens, I'm just gonna be like, holy shit! <laughs> Fuck your level up. Mm. Going to attempt to work tonight. To work. Hopefully it's not... No, man. Wait. Don't, work. Don't go to work. You're sick. What is wrong with you people? I know you have to live and eat and all that, but... Never go to work. <laughs> Don't listen to her. It's not never go to work, but you, you were dying until yesterday. I'm pretty sure you need at least like a day or two rest, man. I say this as a caring friend. Don't do that to yourself. Well, it. Yeah, but they're not gonna pay him, you know, for not being at yeah, work well, a month. Well, a lot of things should, but are not. Oh, look, a bat. So one of those is a Seraphuck. Finish your work and come up. We're locking the main stairs. I've just begun down here. We never lock the main stairs at this time of day. We've had word there may be an intruder. Ah, oh, an intruder? Well, down here? Yes, I, I'm all finished here, sir. You were talking about an intruder? Don't mind me. I'm just doing my job. Okay. Oh, jeez. I knew it was gonna. I would, I'm gonna forget about it. It's gonna scare me. It looked like he was drinking blood straight from his ass. I'm not even kidding. That's like it, that's where it came from. <laughs> what is this? How what is this? The jump over water. It's our one weakness. Aside from you know other weaknesses. 
Oh, it's the glow. Yep, they know when you where you are. Can I can I try to possess that guy? Yeah. Make him kill him. I don't think I can. No, again. I think they're too strong for that. Yeah. You can't insta kill them. You can't do that. Yeah, that's true. You know what? I could trick him like this. Can I jump on him? Nope. The blocks. But I can. No. Okay, good for me. He missed. These glowy assholes are mean. Okay, nice. Way easier than I'm used to. I feel better to the point I think I'd be alright. Also depends on how bad the truck. Don't go to work till Monday. If only I could. He's in America. They don't have health insurance there. They don't even have health there. It's well known. Which is sad. 21st century. Having to deal with that shit. Do we need to jump to another balcony? Okay, climb that the other one and then jump to this one. Why do you have pentagrams here? What are you guys plotting? Where did they come from? Where did they go? What, God and I, Joe? Where'd that come from? Where'd that go? Where'd that come from? Come on, Joe. So this is where... No, oh, the other balcony. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry about that, John. I really am sorry for everyone living in the great US of A. When it comes to that stuff, it's really sad. At least I can go to a doctor... And be like, my head hurts, do something. And they'll be like, get in line, I'm fucking angry, I'm not getting my salary. I'm like, I don't give a shit. <laughs> I have free insurance, I aim to use it. Well, fuck you, well, fuck you too. Okay, get in, you're sick. I know I'm sick, give me a medicine, here's your medicine. Okay, see you later, fuck you, yeah, fuck you too. At least we can do that. So I gotta get there. How? Oh, I probably need to climb the other one. You can't. It won't let you jump where you can jump. Hey, I'm not doing the sound effects. That's just... Maybe? Look. Whee! Yippee! <laughs> it's not the best insurance but it works at least you know you can you can do it you can go private insurance is better sure but there's an option you know what i mean like the thing that every everyone who's employed well every child has it by default every adult person has it well yeah you even have it if you if you're unemployed you just gotta go there every three months to the unemployment bureau and like sign a paper. I'm still unemployed, looking for work, whatever. But uh, if you're in, if you have a job, your uh, employer does it for you. Wait, can I jump? How do I get to that one? That's it's the tricky bit. Yeah, that's the furthest it'll go. The, you know, your employer does it for you, and if you're like we. Well, self-employed, basically running a company. As long as you pay your taxes and your medical on the tax, it's automatically done. Even if it's not, let you. Yeah, even if you like, even if you don't do any of that, even if you don't have it, like, don't do your. If you go there sick, they're not gonna turn you away. They'll be like, oh, sh okay, yeah, you'll get in as a as an emergency case. Of course, private healthcare is better than free healthcare, but free healthcare is always better than no healthcare. Yeah, exactly. How do I jump there? I'm missing something here. It's too far away to jump. 
go. Well, there's a thing to. There's. I need to drain that other. Wait. Okay, that's just a weapon. I need to drain one more of these. See over there. The. Which one? Yeah, that's why. See, water stopped here and there, so I need to do it over there. But I don't know how to jump there. Two. Like, it's right there! <laughs> Let me check that area out. Maybe there's a catapult or something. Oh, maybe I need to climb this? No, that can't be it. That's not it. Oh, yeah! There is a guy! Bravo, love! Doesn't matter, he's up there. Just all I need. Yeah, I forgot about that. Hello, sir. Yeah. I love this charm. Actually, I think this is pretty cool. This charm skill. I could have spent hours here. Thank you, Sash. X. It's like the first Blood Omen, only it, because it's... You kind of see better. Oh, is that like... Are those vampire bones? Yep. Uh, those are vampire bones. Is this like vampire protective pool? I think I need to go into that pipe. No. 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 That's, li that's like saying store-bought cookies are better when your grandmother gives you a bag of cookies she made herself. <laughs> no, they're not. Store-bought cookies can never be better than grandmother's cookies. Uh, I thought he said, because I said private healthcare is better. Store-bought cookies aren't better. Oh no, another glowy asshole. I'm trying. Okay, come down and fight me like a man. I don't know. It has a weird mechanic, but it works. We kind of figured it out. By this point. <laughs> he hits something. Look, he hit something invisible. A little back. So he can only uh, climb things if he can jump w as high as his feet. So his feet need to reach it in order to climb. It's kind of weird. Let's lurk. Oh, I like that. You can actually... You can walk in one direction, hold straight, and then just look around you. Oh, see? He detects me right away. Did you see that? You can't. That's the, that's the issue. He's gonna poke around now until he finds me. I will. You can never fool him. <laughs> no, 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 no! Oh, I hate when they do that. Get up, Kane. Get the fuck up. Why does it take him so long to get up? Yeah. I'll take one hit. Just so I can instantly finish him. And I'm not blocking, so my weapon will uh, last longer. Okay, as long as you know grandma's cookies are better, you're free. <laughs> of course they are! Do you remember oh, Jovanka's cookies? Yeah. No. Oh, yeah, God, what was I doing? Hold on, I need to focus. Okay. Okay, if I had to do that skill block thing, I would kill myself by now. So thank you for making me change it, love. Oh, look, there's another fart generator there. Is that 
Kinda looks. So much unused space. Space. State your business. My business is to kill you, motherfucker. Balls, red balls. <laughs> My grandmother only has store bought. <laughs> she hacked the game. That's it. <laughs> That's good, man. That's that's cool. Stab him in the butt. Yeah. Oh, my powerful sword is going red. I don't like that. So there. Are th yeah. Oh, almost hit that. So I need to go to the other side and get that... Uh, wait, I want to see what's down below. Somebody help me, please. Can I have their blood? Okay. okay. Sasha forbids me killing these peasants. Sasha and Lyubka. I feel worse for the ones in Soul Reaver actually than these ones. Maybe because they're actually... Because they they, they they worship me. It's a selfish goal. Help Please help me, kind sir. What the fuck? Look at this. I'm tired of making fun of this game. I just want to enjoy it. Okay, so we disable that barrier and we enable something here. Cool. Ain't that cool and swell and all. Alright! 1946. Cool. I feel like I've done way more than yesterday's episode. For some reason. EMPs, EMPs about. I can't even tell what it's doing. Oh. So, okay. So now I want to change that to the other side. So this is a... F what is this? A fart splitter? Glyph magic. My ass. Is this the end of the, the level? No. <laughs> that would be cool if this if it were the end of the room. So about so the second and fourth levels had bosses so far. We're gonna save here. It's been a while. Forty-five percent in this level, okay. That's pretty useful, it tells you how much yeah. the amount of level you've beaten so far. I don't know how to w phrase that, honestly. <gasps> Let's see now if it'll repair the sword. Okay, this is the moment. That's what I wanted. Yeah, it repairs it. So it restores the dur durability. Cool. Nice. Stop screaming, man. <laughs> I'm not screaming. I'm not screaming. So let's do more pull ups. S sounds like his uh, his sound effects from the first game, at least yeah, some of them. <laughs> So 
so was it locked because I didn't even try to open Oh, there's a guy with the big glaive thingy, whatever it is. I'm so gonna eat something in this during the the intermission. There's the guy with the glaive. Hold on. Okay, he's coming back. Let's try to jump this asshole. They're saying something important, but I don't have time to listen. I should simply escort you to the garrison. Certainly they would be able to tell you there what is the matter. Oh, very well. Yeah, probably. Like the like the torturing tortured humans when they go, please help me, kind sir. Ah. I love that one, the Serbian folk singer sound effect. Nice, we're gonna get Ah, I wish I didn't open that chest, because I could have, like, boosted his weapon. That would have been badass. Should I load my game? Okay, load. But nope. Oh, it closes the door anyway, I think. Let's check. Oh, look! Now I can go back. I could load my game. Hmm. Load it. <laughs> Kick it. <laughs> yeah. Uh, we'll get to it. Never mind. I'm not gonna slow down, slow the stream down with that, especially before the. Uh... You could do it while it's switching. Come on, do it now! <laughs> Come on! <laughs> I'm trying to save you here. <laughs> oh, my voice is too high pitched tonight. What is? What is this happening to my voice? Maybe, maybe it's all the food I've eaten. Mm. Come on, guy. Come on, I want to fight you. Come on. Come on. I'm, I'm the tiny Arnold. <laughs> oh, God, that was... That was sexy. That was pretty cool. So easily defeated. Ugh. <laughs> Who was that? Garland. Yeah, that's Garland. <laughs> in the Final Fantasy in a nutshell. These guys are like brimming with blood. I thought they had big armors, but I guess they actually have big shoulders. Head and shoulders. I'm still... Still questioning why was there Kane's uh, sigil in that crypt. What is this? Knights of the Tiled Table? It's like someone made it in Minecraft. Look at that. <laughs> Alright. I guess I need to disable that fart field. As guiding? Sorry, what? I already don't know what I said. <laughs> uh, it just happens so often. People ask me something in stream, like uh, that. Obviously, asking, reacting to something I said, and I have no idea what I said. I just keep talking. There was like a puzzle where you had to push in three different tombstones or whatever they are. There were five of them, and only three were pushable, and they had. When you push them, they would reveal Kane's sigil. So I didn't understand why is that there. Oh, there. Ah, uh, no. That's not it. So there's two palings here. I think the kitty opened her mouth. Kane's, Kane's secret stash. Yeah. <laughs> Could be. It was in a weird place. Kitty! I'm glad she's in your lap for one stream. Oh, I probably need to mind control someone again. Where's the switch? There's a switch on this side, right? No, it goes up there, goes there. So, from there it goes. There has to be. There's a guy up there. 
I just need to mind control that fuck and we're done. That's a human, right? Why are they clowns? What am I missing here? Went here? Oh, Alright, Carter. Thanks for dropping by and for spreading the laughs, man. I love that. Sasha's not satisfied with you leaving. You will have to answer to my comrade wife. <laughs> Thanks, man. You have a good night, too. See you tomorrow, hopefully. Uh, stop this, I guess. Stop with this. Can I fight the Seraphim? Nah. So we... Oh, jeez, okay. So we have a glaive guy there. Good to know. Bye, everybody. <laughs> Bye, Dr. Nick. Yeah. Okay, that one still stands. The paling still stands. Bye. <laughs> yeah, of course she's gonna use that. I gotta make a better bye sound effect. Bye. No, I gotta sound more like... Hey, look at this. Hello. What is the sound? Someone had too much cabbage tonight. Hello, zombie. Bye. Yes, OB player. Sorry, zombie. This guy is an ass. That was close. Okay, he's gonna give me a lot of blood. Alright, proper hello. Hello, zombie. <laughs> Not OB player. I miss Outbreak every day, my friend. I was just talking about that today with Sasha. Just some sometimes randomly I do Outbreak cutscenes. <laughs> you can't fool me. You could never fool me. Stuff like that. But I... I, I have obligations, so... <laughs> Hi, everybody! Hi, Dr. Zombie! <laughs> I don't know why I touched on Dr. Nick now. Is this glass or water? Ah, it's water! Yeah. Fucking water everywhere? Why do you have water here, people? Are you insane? Psychos? Uh, I like this. There's some, some exploration. Oh, I'm gonna try to trick him. Sha! Ja! I'm invisible and you can't see me, my man. Now you see me, now you don't. All that shit. At least they don't they can't tell where I am. Like the glowing fucks. Really pays off for the weapon durability, these insta insta kills. That's a lot of blood. Jambe! <laughs> oh, look! Finally, something from the first game, from like known games. That's the Seraphan Lord, or should we say the Hilden Lord? Huh. Are those. Wait, wait, are those the ancients? They have blue skin. Bless you, kitty. Two. Two minutes to IP switch. The hand that plays the soundtrack. No. Because we got to get up early tomorrow, remember? We have an early morning stream with Joe and the gang. Oh yeah, zombie, when do you when do you work this weekend? So if I'm not mistaken, I'm trying to follow this the best as I can. You were working yesterday. You were not working. No, you were working yesterday, so you're free today and tomorrow. Let me know if that's right. Alright, guys, we're gonna take a 10-minute break here for the IP switch. 
And I'll, I'm gonna eat something because I'm hungry. Yes, he's off tomorrow. Okay, then we might shuffle. If Mammon's free, we might shuffle the schedule. Okay, before the IP switch happens, we'll talk about it when I'm back. Ten minutes, don't go anywhere. The stream will cut out, but I'll be back, I promise, with more Blood Omen 2 Legacy of Cain. See you in a few minutes. <laughs> Welcome back everyone to episode 3 of Blood Omen 2 Legacy of Cain. We're doing some shit here. I'm not sure what kind of shit, but we're doing something. That's for sure. But I have I have a difficulty following this game's plot, which isn't that complicated. Yeah. But she was kidnapped, like, right away. Is that where I came from? No, that's the opposite side, okay. Huh. You have mistaken me, madam, for some thing. I am not. Don't waste my time. I know what you are. I work for the Cabal. Now listen carefully. Speak then, madam. What, what is the sound? Is held in one of the upper towers. Very good. How do I get to? Not so fast. You will need to pass this ward gate, and you will need me to open it for you. Then do so at once. In due time. First, there is another task that must be completed. Uh, what task? A nobleman of some importance is visiting the keep at this moment. He must be killed. So that you may open the ward gate. Be a fool. Open it. He must be killed, I tell you. He is a traitor. He has done immeasurable harm to the Cabal. I swear it. Do I look like a common assassin? The ward gate will not be opened until that man is dead. I promise you. His name is Artemis. You will know him by his blue cloak. Artemis. When he is dead, when his lying tongue has been stopped, I will open this gate and not be fooled. Will you do it? Apparently, I have no choice. Go. Kill him, Cain. Rip out his cruel heart. Return when the deed is done. Oh my god. What is up with that sound? It's the second cutscene that has. Is that a glitch? It's gonna be like. Nope. I I love the skill wheel though. Yeah, it's pretty cool. It's one of the better things in this game. So where is that guy over there? They're not really that hard to trick into the mist. Actually rather pathetic with a discerning eye. You can't, the artist was jailed. you can't really so I like when you aim when you lock onto them he, and you're in mist it won't let you get out of the mist limits that's pretty cool get him into the mist and then whoosh off I go am I here? am I there? you'll never find out Where did he go? hmm where did he come from? Where did he go? Where did he come from? <laughs> ah. We gotta make something that rhymes with Cain. Just piling the corpses there. The other guy disappeared. The way their their body shake like la, 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 while you slurp blood from them. I already lost this much. I was full like seconds ago. Hello. Oh wait. Ah, I thought the uh, okay. I thought I did what it was required. So what this guy? Not that good. 
Is there weapons? There's nothing peculiar there. Okay. It's gonna be like the the green guy in the end. The one walking over there. Like, who do I need to kill again, lady? There we go. That sound again. What does it? Why does it do that? Thank, <laughs> thanks, John. Thank you, buddy. Yeah, it opened the way forward. <laughs> Thank you! No, not that guy. Ow! Okay, when you see them doing that... This is unblockable things, thankfully. My sword is about to give out. <sighs> I gotta check out all your emotes when I get to one of your streams, John. When I have a morning off. Maybe Sunday? I'm not... I'm never too sure. <coughs> Now we have a weapon, a weapon weapon. I'm still curious how to get to that because I know I saw there's a guy up there, but I don't know how to get to him. Uh, it's a glaive guardian, whatever. So no. Maybe there's a chest I can open. No, humans can't open them. Only vampires can. You would expect I can climb up there somehow. <clears throat> You know, this could be used as a shortcut. There you go. It's so brooding and... What's the word? Environmental? Like, uh, no, it's... Uh, ambiental, thank you. you. You knew what I meant. Lovely. Yeah, it doesn't have like a groovy soundtrack. Like oh, any of the previous. No, she she opened the force field, so I could go through. Oh, they now they have electric motors. Why do you need glyph fucking magic if you have electricity? Make up your mind. And they're trying to go green here. Hello, kitty. Heh. Yes, kitty, I would also be... Hello. Oh, nice for... Thank you for sending her my way. I didn't. You, you, you cl closed yourself off. Now she's trying hey, to find... Hello. No, it's okay. I'm used Come, to it. Kitty. Look, look, look the way she's sitting on it. I love you, kitty. Come to me. It's too late. You have betrayed her. <laughs> she is now mine. Is there something in that closet, sir? No, there, well, why would there be someone hiding there? I mean... <laughs> I thought for a second you are going to go, No, don't go! go. When I play Mortal Kombat Deception uh, Conquest, you're going to see how much... How... just how much death... No, that's that's different. That's uh, Mortal Kombat Shaolin Monks. The Conquest is the one I recently showed you, where you play Shujinko, the guy who gradually gets older as you play. So you'll see how much this resembles that. The one who played a month ago? Yeah, about a month ago. <laughs> what I love about that game, it has fucking progressive mode, so it's gonna look very sweet on this TV and in the stream. There, that's how we jump over. 
no, I mean... Oh, really? That's my favorite Mortal Kombat 2. Ah! Oh, damn it. Lu Lu <laughs> Lubitz is right. We should get a room. Wait. The ladder. Ah, nice. Yeah, I love Deception. It has, like, the, the first the story. It's the first Mortal Kombat that had a proper story mode. And I really enjoyed playing that. The second thing is. Oh, that's where we started, right? Second thing, the combat itself is just great. Three, two hand-to-hand -hand, uh, combat styles and one weapon style for all of those combatants. And there's a lot of them. It's fucking beautiful. I love the story. I love... Yeah, it has its issues, of course. But this, this is what... <laughs> yes, exactly, man. Exactly. Ah, uh, that's really good news, John. Thank you. Wanted to brush away your fear. <laughs> ah, fuck you, woman. Comrade woman. Make fun of me, will you? Ah, there, there's the guy I wanted to kill earlier. Did you give me enough for a fury? No. Now he has. Just enough. Yes. Do you play that online? You know the servers for that were also brought back online. I keep wanting to play it. But, uh, <clears throat> oh yeah, because I have the PAL version. And only the US version servers work. But I'm totally up for playing that sometime. Deception. I never got to play it online because uh, when I got it. Oh, wait, no, I'm lying. I have. I have played Deception online. A bit, though. Didn't like Armageddon as much. They they put too many. <laughs> they, they put too many combatants, but removed the combat styles. And yeah, the unlockables, the crypt. The crypt was. I think it had both best of both uh, Deadly Alliance and Deception in terms of everything. The, the combat modes and then the, the extras where you see that guy, that one martial artist that Midway had uh, actually motion capturing all that shit. Just beautiful. Yeah, I gotta get the American copy as well. I just have the PAL one. And that one doesn't work online. Which means I'll, I'll be able to unlock everything again. Hehe. <laughs> Okay, okay, so, I did save right now, right? 75%, good! We're actually gonna progress more than in the last episode. We're halfway through the game. I can't believe that this is longer than Soul Reaver 1 and 2. Or maybe just because I know those games better. Especially 1. Are, are they getting high? There's a lot of smoke there. It's black smoke. Some mix of weed and pine cones. Everything is better with a bag of weed. Yes. Yes, after this defiance. <clears throat> Pardon me, I'm going to mute myself for a second. <clears throat> there we go. I had to clear my throat. So, yeah, Defiance after this, which is, it has some huge improvements over the rest of the series. Like fucking subtitles. And it stars both Kane and Raziel. It's, for all intents and purposes, it's Soul Reaver 3, right? But you have Kane and Raziel there, and I guess they just wanted to unify it under the Legacy of Kane banner, because it was confusing for some people. Like, why is there Soul Reaver and Blood Omen? There were supposed to be more games, but they never got to make them, unfortunately. Which is very sad, because Defiance was a, such a step up after this. It was more like Soul Reaver. 
And it starts right where um, Soul River 2 and ends. Ah, damn it, that's so hard to dodge. Now I'm gonna bitch slap him to oblivion. No. Nice. It's not impossible to dodge at least. Cool. <laughs> These guys are just full of blood. That's where all the tax money keeps going. They keep eating all the food. Leaving nothing for the peasants. This is cool. The Minecraft table with a... with a... Is that a hearth? Inside? In the middle? Like if your food is cold you can just heat it up right there. People who have watch watched me for a while know that I love architecture and I love to comment on video game architecture. And one of the reasons why I fell in love with uh, Resident Evil series is beautiful architecture. Well, that's what she was doing. That's what she was doing the last 30 minutes. <laughs> she was listening in. <laughs> we will get a room, just so you don't pester us. You jealous. Ow! Okay, that was fucky. So why 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 in the name of fuck did I do that? Oh, I could go up the ladder, but that guy promises more blood. I gotta get him on this side somehow. Okay, yep. Can't do that again. You gotta wait for him to strike first. Okay, he's dead. The family got theirs, but to me? <coughs> oh dear throat, please clear yourself. So I guess that opened this one? This year I'll see if I can qualify for the health insurance for my job. Wait, you mean you don't have it even from work? I didn't know that. Honestly, wish I don't have to work there, but it is what it is. Yeah. But what do you mean? Wait, so you can have a job, but not health insurance? Because that's insane. I thought, like, if you're unemployed or something. I don't know how it works over there. I mean, I know snippets of it because I talk to people and I've heard stories. I don't know who was it, Dizzy or someone? walking for like two months with a rotting tooth because they couldn't afford it then there's no like you can't just go there and be like please relieve me of my pain they be like Haha, how much money do you have peasant yep yeah, that's that's the proper reaction Oh, that's fucked up in so many ways. Oh, land of the free, huh? Land of the free to die. That's... Pe people agree with that. Look, is that a... First of all, what the fuck is that? Portal to a better game? <laughs> And look at these ballistas, where are they aiming? The walls? <clears throat> okay, over here, there's the elevator. Nice, we've seen that. What the fuck are these ballistas doing here? <laughs> That's sad, John. I wish we could help somehow. 
sad in so many ways. Oh, okay, that's what opened. In that regard, you could say like people in forests of Cambodia have it better. And they have to step on landmines. Well, they had to before the Halo Trust uh, cleared them, but you get my drift. You would think you could go there. Well, probably yes, there's a guy over there. So who can I jump here? Oh, pardon me, sir. I don't believe anyone is allowed up here. You see, we believe there may be a uh, vampire on the premises. The guards have locked all the doors, and the upstairs lever is acting a bit spotty. But it then keeps resetting itself. I would just return downstairs. Thank you for the info, my man. <clears throat> okay, yeah. Yeah. It's just weird from our perspective that like you as a family you can have a member that's not covered. Uh, doesn't matter, like if you live with someone, you're covered, right? Otherwise we'd be doing it wrong. <laughs> Lupka wants to be a social warrior. Yeah. <laughs> you go there with Molotovs, John, go to the Molotovs and show them, show them what you're made of. <laughs> we're not, we're not really condoning throwing Molotovs and stuff at public buildings, only in video games. <laughs> Why are you so <laughs> stuck up tonight? Okay, one lever, then I have to jump to the other one. Oh, it's all the same, is it? <laughs> People know about my love, love with love of Molotovs. Oh, it closes after a while. Okay. <laughs> I'm glad. I don't know, maybe they just forgot to spice it up. <clears throat> That's a good way for me to have a free night at the hotel with bars. Hey, at least you eat on someone else's, uh, yeah. someone else's, uh, at someone ex else's expense, yeah. <laughs> He's not gonna give up on himself at our wake. I don't understand the delay. I need my payment. We will not be making any further payments. But our agreement... Conditions have changed. Our agreement has been suspended. I have deliveries waiting. I can't send them back. Throw them into the sea for all I care. Throw them? We won't be needing them. But my contract. I can go to a higher authority over this. I suggest you take your losses without another word and go. I'll talk to the council. We won't stand for this. By order of the Seraphim Lord, you shall do no such thing! Wait. What are you doing? Oh no. Why did it become visible? Attacking the innocent? The minimum is 725, you make about 1740. Yeah, that doesn't sound bad. I get why. I mean of course improvement would be both, but I um I don't wanna I don't wanna sound like we're like, yeah, you gotta do better, you piece of shit. <laughs> Something like that. Just Lubitsa is worried about you. It's different in our country even with with all the poverty and shit. We, we have some of those things working for us, so to say.
I understand. Uh, trust me, I do. This is a country of lower standards, and even with similar earnings, we're barely, barely going by. Electricity debt is piling up <laughs> until they just plug us off. If the stream cuts out, you know what's ha what happened. I just told you, and I get it. In the U.S., it must be way harder. Where some things like the rent is stupidly more expensive. Okay, let's pull the switch. The adult life, they told us it's gonna be awesome. Nobody said we're gonna all Jesus Christ. Wait, what's up with the open oh wait i have to at least i'm not a clown or am i there has to be something that opens this ah this is one of the most interesting skills really <coughs> Pepe touch. Yeah, I've seen that. I've seen so much of that in the uh, in the what 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 do you call the thing that I did like uh, truck dispatch thingy uh, brokers like so truck load brokers they would have to do questionable stuff, like really immoral stuff to to progress. And those who didn't have the guts for it to, you know, to be such people, they wouldn't, uh, they wouldn't get promotion. They wouldn't get promoted. Basically, they would just fall off, get another job, and you could see who's like made for that. Aside from like, you know, butt kissing, you had to be terrible to your colleagues to be better, which just fosters oh, a horrible culture. Woo! Almost singed myself there. Okay, I saw a, a checkpoint. Yeah. Is that a glowing seraphan? Oh no. Okay. Okay, that fury really pays off. I'm glad they are, man. That's why you're my friend. Because you're a good guy. You're good, comrade. You're very good. Bodies were found downstairs. The intruder is near. I want you to patrol the courtyard. Sounds like Vorador. Yes, sir. I got the cell. Move out. <laughs> what the fuck? They have Schwarzenegger here. Yeah. Oh god, no. Oh god, no, I can't. Come on, come on, come on. I don't know why I can't do it. Last night I was so good at it. No, 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 I'm not there. I'm not there, you asshole. Damn it, why do they have to turn the moment I approach them? What, do you sense a tickling behind you? Fucking die. <laughs> I'm a man, baby. Come on. What what is wrong? Like last night it sounded so good. Maybe it's just <coughs> Maybe it's all all this throat trouble. Maybe it's my squeaky voice. I lost I I <laughs> I pinched my testicles and now I have this voice. Maybe it's all the red bulls I've eaten. They gave me levels, but they also took my manliness away. 
Come on. I'm trying to save you here. That was better. Okay, you just keep charging there. Okay, that was cool. And I have the full rage bar. Okay, there was the big... <laughs> there was the big Arnold guy there. I want his flesh. <laughs> Thanks, love. Okay. Can I approach that guy invisible? Ooh. Yeah, okay. Uh, um, mm, I, gotta, I gotta clear my throat again. Pardon me. I thought I didn't uh, didn't mute myself for a second while I was doing like blah. <laughs> didn't even ask for my PP. I'm offended. <laughs> oh, you can strafe. Let's get it. Ah, he's a glowy asshole. Okay, good thing I saved all that fury. Bitch slapping. Ah, oh, fuck. At least he'll have a lot of blood in him. Come on, Arnold, come on. I want your blood. I'm trying to save you here. Eat my tortilla, will you? <laughs> this summer, Arnold Schwarzenegger is the little tortilla boy. I miss that guy. I don't know if he's still doing stand-up comedy. Uh, um, mm -mm. Come on! Open the fart valve! That's my trigger word for for Arnold voice. Come on! <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it did. There she is, Booba. I mean Uma. I thought no one would dare attempt to rescue me. You are either brave or foolish. You will find me relentless. <sighs> There must be a glyph nearby that powers the ward. Find it and shut it down. What was it that you learned in the industrial quarter? Tell me in case I cannot free you. Tell you now, before I am freed? What would you do in my place, Kane? I would offer my rescuer a token of trust. That information is for Borador only. Haven't I earned your confidence yet? You have not rescued me yet. Because she wants to trick him? I will return shortly. Oh my god, this is so demeaning. Demeaning? Is that the word? To Kane? Like, yeah. She'd be like, God fucking damn it. They just rescued you. Tell me what I need to know or I'm just gonna leave. You fuckhead. So what, that's it? We don't even go to get to her? Ah, oh, she's just... She's blue balling and cock blocking him. Maybe now? Transfer this? Again, there's no one to mind control. Nope, that's not it. Hmm. That's definitely not it, but I'm pretty sure that controls the. If I could destroy this fart wall, that would be awesome. What, what did I miss? No, between, like, things, John, I will always remind you when needed. Huh? So I... he said that, uh, 
<laughs> okay, <laughs> I see now. The message ran past me. Hmm. She's worth a million? Sold? Who wants her for a million? <laughs> uh, well, I'm rich. I have four of them anyway. No, it wasn't. I can do worse. You know that. <laughs> then, what's the what's the solution to this? I don't have a million. <laughs> they have a fire here. Hmm. That's the door. I can't open the door. That that one opens and closes the door. If it'll nope, it won't even work. So we, we got to do something. He said, I'll be right back, and then what? If there was a human here I could control. Maybe there's someone around her I can control. I don't know. Or s <gasps> Maybe there's someone up here I can control. <laughs> Look at that flag. It has a stroke. So this is their fortress. It's pretty bare bones. Something about that, but somehow I need to block off the fart generator here. Maybe I need to just whack it. No? Whack it. Because that's what powers it. 100%. Now how, how could I... Maybe I can cut this? No? I don't have any new powers. There's what? Three more bosses to kill. Okay. Wait. I got the jump. Oh, I started with Fury. Okay, okay. Some pocket lint. <laughs> car keys and some regret. <laughs> sure, man. For you, always. <laughs> I'm especially interested in, in that pocket lint. Yeah, that one goes there. Oh, wait, wait, there's a, is there someone up there? Is that what I'm missing? No? EMP. This is a big one. I'm just gonna buy a new thermostat. I just noticed that this is only comes from the storage heater. And that thermostat was bad. So that was the one we got from warranty. Because the first one that came with it was shit. Then we used the warranty. Called, called on a warranty, whatever the word is. And, um... Uh, they gave us this one, which is shit, so I had to fix it myself, and it's still not good. It's kind of better, but not. So we're just gonna go buy another thermostat. Because the, the the small heater doesn't do that, if you noticed. Yeah. It keeps turning on and off and nothing. It's very bad, badly put. Oh, there it is. That's it. You just pull the statue. But not in the way I thought. You couldn't pull it to the left, because that would block the thing. Wait, how can I? Ah, now I can divert the thing. Yeah. Now it makes sense. I was like, how, how the fuck can I even enter there? 2051. Okay, we got about an hour. I am enjoying this. Cool. A lot. It's a different kind of enjoyment from playing Soul Reaver. Though I miss like grand grandiose cutscenes and music, but it's still fun. Let me see. <laughs> if it's not Canadian dollars, it's useful. Damn it, Lubitsa. <laughs> uh, in order to get it, though, I have to bleed myself dry. Just talk to Kane. That's, that's what he does. <laughs> that's literally his job. Is that a telescope? Or do we have stargaze? Oh, that's an observatory. Cool. They, they're embracing science slowly but surely. So what? Do I have to kiss the cage to talk to her? Oh look, before I start it. Look at these things. This thing here. And then this thing here. It's pretty cool. You have to kiss You're the cage. Hurt. It's nothing. We must get to Oh my gosh, she has boom physics. Once I am outside these Did you see that? walls, I can use a spell to transport us back to sanctuary. 
That's where the resources for the game went. Isn't it? No! At last. One living soul disturbs my world. What creature dares shed the blood of my servants? He had the sword. Soul Reaver, the prize I had won a lifetime ago, was in his foul possession. What is this? You know me. No. You were utterly destroyed so easily. Your name was drowned in the black waters of passing time. Huh? All your plans were set alight and seared to smoke and ashes. Let those words be your epitaph. What you words? Dare dream of killing me. That fantasy was quenched in blood long ago when I defeated you. And yet, you have learned nothing. Such a pathetic creature. Dare you to challenge me again? Die, fiend! No, the pain! Your death is fated at my hands. How many times must I teach you that lesson? He is too strong for you, Cain. With the Soul Weaver, he can kill us both. We must flee and fight him when we are stronger. No. Release me. That demon of filth is mine. I <laughs> am your fate, Cain. Now and forever. However long you live, you will come to me for your could you kill those birds? Cause they're like they're drowning the conversation. Jesus fucking Christ, audio guy, what were you doing? Uma, alive and safe. Cain, you have all our thanks. I can follow orders when it suits me. We met the Saraphan Lord. He showed himself? He is a touch more powerful than I expected. And he has the soul, Reaver. Strange that you did not tell me this at the first. You are not ready to fight the Seraphim Lord. I told you that. It was only by good fortune that we escaped. Vordor, I must speak with you. You have information for us, I know. You may speak. I was in the heart of the main factory in the industrial quarter. Before the guards discovered me, I had found a huge central chamber that housed some kind of magic portal. This portal looked into a place the likes of which I had never seen before. And this portal was held open by a single source of magic, a stone set on a pedestal. The Nexus Stone? Borador, I believe it was the Nexus Stone. The Nexus Stone? Of course. What is this thing? Explain. The Nexus Stone is an item of great power. It can bend time and space to create doorways to any location within Nazca. Demon Realm? I know not why the Seraphan Lord would yep. be using it within the Industrial Quarter. Well, yeah. But we could put it to great use. And what use is that? One who wears the stone cannot be harmed by the Soul Reaver. And is this but a legend to be proved false at the fatal moment? Oh, no. No legend at all. It has been proven. The Seraphan Lord wore the stone when he defeated you 200 years ago. What? How else could he have resisted the power of the Soul Reaver? You were unable to use the sword's power, and without it, he was able to defeat you. Then I shall take the stone and use it to kill him. But know this, when I recover it, I will also claim ownership of it. I trust that is understood. Then you commit yourself to fighting the Seraphan Lord? There can be no turning back. I was committed to that from the moment you revived me. Nothing will turn me away. So be it. You must use the subway to reach the industrial quarter, which lies in the northeastern part of the city. Find your way past the gate that blocks the townspeople from entering. But perhaps we may leave that to your invention. Uma? Once in the quarter, look for the main factory complex. It is there that the stone is held. I will return with the Nexus Stone and the Saraphan Lord's head. Is it loading? Okay. Chapter six: The Nexus Stone. Okay, we're we're the Nexus Stone. <laughs> the Nexus Stone. The Nexus Stone. I remember that. Everybody asking the same question. I left the relative safety of sanctuary and ventured once more 
into the night. The industrial quarter of Meridian was, I discovered, a heavily guarded fortress. Rather than assault it directly, I stole into the workers' commons and began my quest for the Nexus Stone there. Bioshock Infinite. Looks like it, kind of, I mean, the same kind of backdrop. The Den Buggy? Oh, like Doom Buggy. Oh, um, I have control, never mind. Didn't notice that. Okay. Let's see. Save 1% industrial quarter. All right. Uh, sorry, bro, I forgot. Gotta go silent. I'll got my bro in trouble. What? I don't know what you mean. Like if 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 you think you're getting me in trouble, don't pull it. Don't draw attention to it. That's the only adv uh, uh, advice I can give. But no, you didn't say anything like against Twitch's toss, terms of service, and all that. <laughs> uh, up with the dollars, down with the dinars. Yeah, you can talk about dollars and all that. There's more guards about than ever these days. I seen two of the bastards yesterday and three today. Ooh, they make my flesh crawl. And they talk, I never heard them. Why so many of them nowadays? Hold on. They must be here for our protection. Business. Sorry. No, what I mean is something. <laughs> yeah, I gotta address that. So we we try not to touch on political and religious and you know that kind of stuff topics because a some rando could cause trouble. I doubt they could really really get me banned unless I uh, encourage that. But. You know, you never know. I've seen things happen on Twitch, and we just start try to steer away from it. The other reason is people come to streams to relax and forget about politics and their daily lives and all that. So we don't want to, you know, no streamer I know wants to talk about what you know that kind of talk. It's not that we don't want to talk about it, but not in the stream. It's not the place for that. So like, you know, national conversation, whatever national. Um, jokes on national basis and stuff like that we avoid them even if I don't know I'm still working on that still still finding a middle ground because I'm a comedian first at least I think I am and uh, is the gas coming and but it's hard nowadays because there's so many things you can't joke about you can offend this or that and twitch will you know, be on the side of... Oh, yeah. Okay. What would I do if it went the other way? Which will be on the side of... On, on you know, of the offended party more often than not. Not because I think they really care about any kind of... Like most big companies about these uh, agendas. Just because, well... They bring in money. That's why YouTube does it. Well, that's why Twitch does it. Let's not fool ourselves that it's some kind of higher goal or whatever. Everybody knows it's not. It's just you can abuse it or you can be honest about it. And yeah, that's 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 it in a nutshell. What the 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 Canadian? Don't, nah, <laughs> I don't think that's really. If if somebody gets offended because of that. I think Canadians will only apologize for not having a better dollar. <laughs> so what was the other one? What was the other? What if I... I'm gonna, I'm gonna divert that fart juice... Uh, fart pipe... To the other side. Does it close the doors as well? You mind your business, I'm trying to solve a puzzle here, woman. 
Oh, it doesn't close it, so we'll need that afterwards. <coughs> <laughs> yeah, you can you you don't know. It's hard. It really is. A lot of comedians have complained, like we're serious world-renowned comedians have complained about not being able to joke uh, about many you know many oh look at the mugs what ale in them mm. um yeah about not being able to joke and i think junk lee said it well uh that you know we shouldn't Hold on, I gotta focus. As soon as I kill this guy. Nice! I can't believe I dodged that. Alright. So John Cleese said something very interesting on that uh, topic. That... We can't really grow and overcome bad things if we don't joke about them. So, in actuality, nothing should be off topic for comedy. I mean, why is it okay for South Park and, I don't know, Simpsons and Family Guy, but not for just, not for me or John or you? Well, because money. And everybody knows that, but. It's like, it's not a secret, it's so obvious, but yet, everybody's playing dumb, because people can't speak up. I think we should speak up, but in a smart way. Now, I don't know how we got to this conversation, I mean, I, I know how, just, <laughs> it's funny how we got here, but I think it should be addressed. I don't want anybody to feel like they can't talk in my streams, it's just like that in any stream most streams i don't know if there are political streams on twitch really it's like because then you would have to have a separate channel political tesla <laughs> where we talk politics so you don't mix the two look at this it's a they have better bathtubs than we do did you see that i don't know if you were watching oh they're talking Speak the fuck up, please. I'm interested in what you have to say. That's an evil kind of thumb. What should we do? I always do. Go on like we never heard nothing. I never heard nothing. That's what I'm telling you, bot. That's exactly it. That's exactly. Just play dumb and we'll be okay. Well, no. Don't play dumb. <laughs> we fight to fight so you can see the sight. <laughs> Uh, John, have you ever played that? The, uh, <clears throat> the, oh, Dr. Baby, <laughs> welcome to the stream, Dr. Baby, thanks for following, <laughs> appreciate it. Okay, wow, that hurt, okay, this, this lady is furious, she's got new moves, but same ability to die oh my god he's literally drinking from her boobs no that oh <laughs> that was so impolite ah. no fuck that this glaive is better thank you dr baby <laughs> slash him up son i read stash him up slash him up son <laughs> The question was, have you played... Oh, fucking EMP, hold on. Have you ever played Rogue Trip Vacation 2012? The PlayStation 1 game that's like Twisted Metal, but with a twist. So I was reminded of it. I played it as a kid a long time ago, but I was reminded of it. So when you play Duke Nukem Time to Kill, if you hold like all four shoulder buttons uh, when the game is loading, uh, actually when the GT Interactive or Take-Two logo appears, depending on the region, GT Interactive in the US and uh, uh, Take Two in Europe. He actually plays the Rogue Trip Vacation 2012 uh, intro, and it's just hilarious comedy game where you drive cars and you try to take the tourists because this guy, Big Daddy, it's like 
2012 apocalypse for those of you who haven't played the game <laughs> i just i just say go right now to youtube and find the uh rogue trip 2012 uh, vacation 2012 uh intro it's hilarious <laughs> but this like in short the story is everything is held by this big daddy guy who's like a mutated giant human and uh, his finger is like my whole arm and thick and people pay thousands of dollars just to go and like vacation and the only less irradiated place in the earth but uh yeah yeah <laughs> i know it was like 1998 that makes it even funnier 2012 apocalypse <laughs> but anyway uh so these i forgot what they're called a a of a like all something of auto mercenaries i forgot the name of the group they're like they look like fallout raiders and they interrupt like the the, the, the program that's going on like the ad for big daddy's wonderland <laughs> Yes, <laughs> yeah, something like that, and uh, it is like it starts with those words. The year is twenty twelve, something like that. <laughs> and uh, anyway, this group basically they make it cheaper for tourists. So if you can't, <laughs> if you can't afford to go to Big Daddy Land, you just get into these one of these crazy driver vehicles and they're like twisted metal they have fucking battle tanks they have a, a biohazard truck they have all sorts of shit and they all like shoot each other with crazy weapons but the point of the game other than just to kill other players is to have the tourist in your car and while you're driving around killing everybody else they're taking photos like that's what that's what pays you so you can upgrade your vehicle and move on it was a very interesting concept like it was a good twist on twisted metal formula so i gotta i gotta get that game again <laughs> i miss it every time i boot up duke nukem time to kill i just do that code like for the secret trailers just so i could watch that Will you follow these humans never look twice in my direction. Little do they realize their future lord walks among them. Now, tell me of this place. Look, Umar tells me the Nexus Stone will be found in the main factory beyond the dam. There will be a gondola to take you there. If this is deactivated, you must look below for the glyph to repower it. But be careful of the guards. Have you any further wisdom to dispense? I sense the presence of another vampire close by. He may be watching you. I will whisper you again when it is whisper. Once again, I began to feel the obligations of power. To deal justice fairly to all. One day, my people would know me again for their lord. But the vampires who were traitors to their kind would know me first of all. Such heavy dialogue for such a dumbed down game. Do I want to go down there? Are these battle toads? There you go. Well, they can do that now. Oh, that one died of her own volition. These glaives are just too good. If they're glaives, I'm not sure. They're so fucking good. <laughs> the 90s were fucking wild, yeah. All PS1 games of this time look like they were made by Tim and Eric? Wait, wait, is that... Hold on. No, that's not it. I, I, what is that? Please tell me. <laughs> you only work two days next week. Good! That's pretty good, considering your current state, man. That's That makes me happy. And zombie, too. Wait, zombie. If you work every third day and you work tomorrow, then you'll work Tuesday, then you'll work... Friday. Huh! It is true, you are only working two days next week. <laughs> I love his schedule. I mean, I don't like the 24 hour shift part, but I love everything else about it. Oh, nice. Like, fucking ambiental sounds are better than the game sounds. 
You gotta survive for the next five days of work. Yeah, John, while you're here. Yeah, okay, I didn't know Zombie was still there. Since Zombie mentioned uh, Outbreak yesterday. So if we were to squeeze in tomorrow evening an Outbreak episode, could you do it? For the blue balls, man? Look, I found the blue balls. Could you do it for the blue balls? Oh, wait, you work? No, you said you work. Okay. I'm full of blue balls. What is this? So, the same around 11. We're trying to start at like... It would be ideal to start at 11. 11. It's just so we have full two hours to the IP switch. But since we're just doing end of the road. And then just fucking around with some... Um, uh, with some showdowns or eliminations. It's not as stiff as usual. Yeah, yeah, let us know. So I'll keep it open. The schedule will still say Blood Omen 2, but uh, we could do this. Because Zombie's working. Wait, Zombie's working? No, wait. What am I saying? Zombie's working tomorrow or Sunday. I mixed something up. Zombie, correct me. I said it, I said it correctly uh, last time, but now I'm not sure. Oh god, that's that's really okay, when I see that better run. But you're running away? Come back. Oh how how am I gonna kill her if she's running? Oh. oh, they also have the shit ton of blood. Okay, gotta change my weapon, unfortunately. Too bad I love that glaive. I want more. I might be wrong, John. Zombie will correct me if I'm wrong. I think he's working... Wait, he worked yesterday. I think I was right when I said he worked yesterday. So he's working Sunday. Yeah, so we could do it tomorrow. I think I got that right, but we'll see. We shall she. Zombie is a slow typer, but he's this, he's an efficient typer. Okay, I guess the fart gas. Could you please move? Just fucking move, man. Yeah, there we go. Fart pipes activated. Anything else down here? There are stalls. Oh, is that cured fish? Cured meat? Mmm, yummy. It's all 2D though. What is this? A piece of machinery? I swear to God, I'm gonna go heatless. Just because of these EMPs. I think that's it. Not much to find here. I need to use that ladder and that's it. That's it! One ladder, ha ha ha. Two ladder, ha ha ha. So barren. All this space used for nothing. Okay. Let's climb up. Up we go. Ha ha ha. Is that a bone? That's a. Is that a wrench? Oh, what the fuck is this? Look at this! Look what I found! I'm gonna take this. Yeah! It's a cool weapon. I thought it was a wrench. I almost didn't take it. Is this open? Ha ha ha. Zoop. Whoop. Oh, is that chest there open? I should just jump for it. Whee! Oh, that's the blue ball chest. We've seen that. Up we go. What was that? There is nothing here. I feel tricked. 
Oh Papa, no way, Comrade Kane. Wow! <laughs> I just imagined him as he's flying over, like, wow! No blood left for me, ha ha ha. Okay, now we activate Doohickey. Nothing to pick up here. Doohickey activation initiated. Door open. Proceeding with the next phase. Oh, it's gonna be one of them. Oh, mist areas. So I don't don't want the mist to cut out. I think. They're making fucking mist for me. Look. They have radios now? What did you do to Nazgut? What did you do to fucking Nazgut? That's not the Nazgut I remember. What bullshit is this? Oh, you agree. Come on, love. What the fuck? Now we have fucking radios? Which one of this, these is a soldier? That's a soldier? But how do I get them to? I'll just have to fight him. Mano y mano. Maybe if I stop being invisible for a second, draw him in and then become invisible? You fucking blind man? Now that'll have to do. Ah, fuck. That's not what I wanted. Okay, there's two of them. That's not good. That's definitely not good. Let's draw him out. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die so bad. Ah, this is so janky. Why is it so fucking janky? It's not good. Ah, my weapon. My beautiful weapon. I had it for like two minutes. It's not good. It's not fucking good. I don't like it. I want my weapon back. I love that weapon. Will you follow? Oh, it's gonna These do the same thing again. My direction. Little do they realize their future lord. So Wednesday, so he's working on now, Sunday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Place. Okay, so tomorrow Uma we could do it. Me the Nexus stone will be found nice, nice. The main factory hey, Ray or Gray. I'm never sure. Is it like bounding Ray or bounding Gray? And it's wordplay. You gotta explain your name. But thank you for dropping by. Welcome. How are you feeling? What's up? Have you any further wishes? How's I sense the presence How's of another vampire clone. Resident Evil Progenitor of treating you? What is it called? I will Silent Home. Again. Sweet Home. Sweet Home. The Once again, I, began to I so want to play that game. It's totally my jam. It's like to deal JRPG with horror. Horror they JRPG. Does it get better than that? But the How's the game, by the way? To their kind would know me first of all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now I don't have a weapon. You fucking cheating game. At least I know where to find that thing. I'm gonna need her sword. There's another one coming. Oh, now we're gonna dance that dance. Ah, trick me. When they do that fourth hit, that's so cheap. No! Oh, I, oh, it's so bad. At least they have a ton of blood. Did you see that? <laughs> I fucking fell off! Oh god! I'm coming for you as soon as I eat these blue balls. Mmm, those are my favorite. They give me a lot of XP. I think I keep the XP after dying, but uh, again I didn't check, because that's not my preoccupation when I'm dying. Bound in Grey, it was from a therapy piece, therapy? I wrote about my depression, aha, uh -huh. and then that crap old lady bondage book happened, oh god. Answer to whatever. Bounding gray. Okay, okay. That that makes more sense. I was like, is there a manta ray or something you're bounding with magic? Of course I thought that, love. What do you... 
What do you think? I'm a walking dead joke. Of course I thought. Dead, please? Oh no, they're not dead. Oh cool, at least I caught her in weakness. Okay, now you give me your blood, comrades. I need more blood. You took my blood, I, I took your blood. It's tit for tat. Or whatever you call it here in this version of Nose God. I know which book she means. <laughs> but that, we gotta do the whole thing. Fifty Shades of Grey, I'm assuming. That's like the, the only thing that comes to my mind. There's the Super Sword. Okay, this time I'm not losing the Super Sword. I'm gonna fuck those assholes up. Wait, I have Fury. I'm gonna use it. Fuck you. Nice. You deserve it. <laughs> God, I don't know why, but when he's... Like doing it, when he's sucking blood from women, it comes straight from their chest. Just <laughs> you couldn't align it differently. Maybe that's what they wanted. Who knows? It still was early 2000s. It was just. I I mean, if they could program strong boob physics in in Uma, why not this? Really? <laughs> Goes. <laughs> Yeah, f Fifty Shades of Grey. <laughs> yeah, she did. She did ask. That's why I said it. I see. That's why I wrote. So my my first contact with that book was when a friend. I don't know if you guys know what Zelda Universe is. It's like that one. It's probably the largest Legend of Zelda forum. So two or three guys. Uh, got together on Skype and read the book. <laughs> it was some of the funniest shit I've heard because they all had specific voices. Uh, very... What's the word that I'm looking for, love? Very... Not, s not specific, but like... Recognizable? Impactful? Woo, you can jump up. Distinct, thank you. Distinct voices. Uh, one of them had a really deep but like posh British voice. I can't. I can't do the two at the same time. Uh, the other one had a high, higher pitched voice like this, uh, kind of like like that. And I forgot what the third guy was, but uh, they they did it magnificently. Maybe the third white guy was just. Uh, a recording engineer I don't know but that's that's how I found found out the book about the book I was like what the fuck are they reading I never heard about it before and then someone explained on Skype and I was like, ah <laughs> Morshi hola Morshi hola mi amigo como estas Morshito <laughs> yeah I'm at the fourth fourth um, at, at the fourth game man this one is the worst in the series it's still fun to play, but as far as the story goes, it's compared to the rest of the Legacy of King games, just bad. Maybe I can make them chase me? Hey, I'm right here, dude. About what? Oh, right, we can do that. Ah, I wanted to dodge that. These guys really not afraid to use that move. Oh, they're dodging nicely. Ha! What is up with these guys? They're like from another game completely. Oh, no, no, dodge! Wait, can I go mist? Because that would be really cool. Or, or just fury them. There we go. 
You really got to dodge these guys. They don't fuck around. Ah, EMP. Got to pause. Woo! Lost everything there. Bien. Bien. Oh, good to hear. Yeah, I'm doing great. I'm plowing through these Legacy of Game games. Can't wait, wait to get to Defiance. Because uh, that's going to be a lot better than this. It's just something odd. Like when a game... When you have... Four games with superb gameplay and story, and then comes something like this. Three games, right? We have three so far, yeah. Each one better than the last. Thank you for the bits, Morshima, man. Thank you, appreciate it. Are you sweet? Are you sweet, Morshi. Uh, hello, sir. You have th they have fucking gramophones now, or whatever this is in Osgood. It just takes me out of it. Went from medieval. It was medieval in Blood Omen. Like, uh, how it doesn't make sense in Soul Reaver One either, e because Soul Reaver One should be like 900 years after this game, and there wasn't such technological advancement. It was just they had like fucking switches. That's that was the the top of their. I don't know. Did she grab you, kitty? Come down. Yeah, it sounds like 1930s Americana. It's probably some, uh... Yeah. Instead, we get a different timeline that doesn't connect to anything. Just shows the healing. Hey, kitty. Calm your claws down. Oh my gosh, she opened her mouth again. Why do you like doing that? below my face she just comes below me my face and goes <laughs> yeah I'm okay with her drooling just the smell that's the only part of the cat that smells actually okay we powered something with fart magic drink 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 Wi-Fi drinking yeah <laughs> Wi-Fi drinking that that's that's it these guys have sabers so so now we have Middle East warriors in here. They look like it kind of and look they have some kind of kukri or saber saber. Uh saber. Oh there's a checkpoint there. Nice. So there was the, the second guy. Okay, at least I know where they came from. Plot twist Mickey Mouse was a vampire. <laughs> yeah, this is this is Mickey Mouse's youth. Before Walt Disney discovered him, he was actually Kane. Look at all those mugs. <laughs> Where'd I come from? Where'd I go? Where'd I come from? Cut Nigel. Oh, hell yeah! A glaive! Are you gonna say something interesting? They're probably talking the game just didn't... <laughs> the game just didn't load... Uh, load up... Their voices. Citizen McCain! <laughs> Alright, another checkpoint. That, I'm pretty sure that's a sound effect from Soul Reaver 1 when you open the checkpoint. A checkpoint. So what's going on here? What the hell is going on here? Why can why can I jump over that? Just fucking invisible walls cock blocking me. Halting my progress. You agree, Kitty, don't you? She agrees. Uh-huh. Is it boss time? 2132. We might be able to finish another level. Oh yeah, I love Cuphead. The only reason why I quit it, man, was because I first actually played it with Sasha, but I quit it because I was like, I need to dedicate my time to this. This is good. This is exactly what I like. Like the NES era, uh, shoot 'em ups, beat 'em ups, platformers, like all of that, but with uh, please stop yawning in my direction. What is wrong with you today? I gave you too much meat to eat. But with the animations are fucking stellar. It's so they really tried hard to take that uh, to copy that 1930s. Um, what is it called? Rubber hose animation style. It's wonderful. It feels like you're watching one of those cartoons. 30s, 30, not even 50s was already like color cartoons. 1930s. That's when they used the rubber hose animations. They called it like that because the characters' arms are always like flapping like 
like uh, rubber hoses. Oh, you were already ready for that? Okay, someone's throwing something at me. Ow! That hurts more than the fucking sword. I better be here where I'm safe. Ow! Okay, I'm I'm liable to die here. There's another one, but she hits me, I'm dead. What can I do though? I wanna try to jump over the projector. I'm so dead. Okay, Glaive, save my life, please. Oh, excellent. I'm gonna live. Oh, I was so close. <laughs> yeah, that is pretty human, Morshi. It is. People, like humans, are afraid of change. Innately. That's just how it is. But if you can beat that impulse inside you, you can do great things. All the great minds were... Um, have beaten that impulse inside them. It's hard. I find myself sometimes like, I don't like this, I like the old way. But, you know, if you can, if you can beat that, you won. You can, you can ascend higher. I don't know how to explain it. It's not Disney. Disney actually had, Disney didn't do much rubber hose animation. Not even, like even the first, um, even the first Mickey Mouse, it wasn't really a rubber hose. It was uh, MGM, I think, and another company that did early cartoons. They had those. It says, like if you go to Wikipedia, it'll say w exactly which companies inspired it. It's this one. Furnace 1. Furnace 2. Is that it? Oh, there's four of them, okay. But yeah, the gameplay is wild in the Cuphead. It's so fast-paced and crazy. You really need all your reflexes. Not old, just any humans are like that. It doesn't matter, matter if you're old or, or young or, or in the middle. It's just a well-known thing. We just like the... We, we're afraid of change. That's why... For instance, people stay with wrong partners because, well, I have a good way of explaining that. That's like, that's why people don't find better jobs, why they stay where they are, a lot of shit. It's because, um, um, what is it called? Well, my example is, like, for an average human, you get beaten in a spot every day and... You can either stay there and get beaten every day, or you can uh, move to a different spot where somebody, where there's a good chance nobody will beat the shit out of you. Most people, like eight out of ten people, if not more, will uh, choose to stay where they are. And the the logic behind that is, at least here, I know who's beating the shit out of me. If I move, it could be someone else. But yeah, but also if you move. It could be no one, <laughs> no one at all. It's just how we are. What is this? Oh, it's some kind of a ju fart juice doohickey. Okay, I guess I had to follow follow the the trail. It was inspired by the rubber hose style from the golden age of American animation and the subversive and surrealistic qualities of works of Walt Disney Animation Studios. And yeah, that those are the guys I meant. Fleischer, Fleischer Studios, Fleischer, Fleischer, those guys. I will, Fleischer, Fleischer? Damn, if Carter were, were here to tell us. Whoa! Oh, 
Uh huh. More cured meat. Yummy. That guy appeared out of the wall. <laughs> the fuck are you doing, man? I think he's jogging. They're all jogging. Hmm, that looks like hot lava soup over there. Never seen anything like that? Don't touch it. God damn it. I hate when it interrupts a cutscene. It's magical and dangerous. Oh, they say they EMPs. The workers move them all the day. Come on, won't do any harm to Can explode. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Blow up in his face. You okay, Kane? They opened the door for you at least. You should be happy, man. Just dusts off and continues on his merry way. Wait, we have a battle? Against whom? But that guy up there? Better drink his blood before the other one approaches. Ah, oh, you gonna... Ah, oh, that didn't pay off. Oh. Okay, that guy should be dead. Cool. I thought I, I would be a gunner if I didn't dodge that. Nice. He's dead. Woo! Woo wee! It's true that you get more resistance to new stuff uh, as you get older, but but it's just in human nature it's not we're like that <laughs> i finished that meal i'm gonna finish this guy as well almost a level purple bar is almost full okay fury pays off really pays off calm down guys i'm not gonna touch you so he said i need to use the subway that's probably what he meant i need to power up the subway now at least they opened the door for me can i go uh can i check that out outside maybe chest something no doors no barrels can't touch anything in this game oh what is this google I, I, that's so that's the only thing i can read here Go google if anybody can read this i would be very grateful Bottle, bottomless bottle. It's also kind of paradoxical because humans, one of our greatest attributes is adaptation. We adapt to any environment and anything if we have to, but if we don't, we don't really have to, we're really lazy to do it. How we we started talking about fucking cuphead how do we get to like human philosophy <laughs> oh beers beers everywhere beers beers everywhere beer for me and beer for you there's a checkpoint right here yay subway <laughs> subway or the highway my way or the subway Shoom. so we move that one huh how deep into this I am got about 18 minutes left hmm I think I should add, end it here to be fair 25% yeah I'm not finishing this level I doubt I'll <laughs> down boy I doubt I'll reach the next checkpoint but let me check would be a shame to waste this sword. Maybe there's gonna be a checkpoint after I get off the tram. Whee! Oh, 
Those wheels were turning backwards, weren't they? Weren't they? They were supposed to be turning the other direction if I were... Ah, yeah, there's a checkpoint. Cool. I think they put that one there just in case the game glitches from all the huge environments. That's pretty cool looking though. Yeah, it's not that we can't, but we don't want to that because it's comfortable the way it is. Exactly. Well, there's also a huge play, a uh, huge influence is the uh, negativity bias, the confirmation bias, and a lot of those psychological uh, processes that we don't think about. Our inner, what is it called? Ah, surprise, asshole. Surprise, cockface. What is it called? The inner... That Peter guy in his book called it the chimp, in the chimp paradox. It's basically the, uh, the primal part of us that's, that reacts to danger. It also spoils things a lot for many pe people. But the more you're... No, no. The saber is good, but I'm gonna go with the seraphim sword. Long sword, I guess. The more you're aware of these things, the more better chances you are. That's why mindfulness is pretty big lately. If you're aware of your actions, how you affect others, as well as how they affect you. No, no, none of that shit, please. Yeah, that's better. That's not really a good place for fighting. Nice. No, stop running. No kitty, that hurts. Ugh. Also, I love the one thing that Matthew taught me. Oh, you, you wanted help, actually. Oh, that was bad. I'm gonna have to whack her, silly. I'm gonna focus on the other one. She's dead, okay. Don't, don't. As long as she doesn't push me down. Ah, oh, god damn it. Stop doing that. Ugh, kick her in the balls. Uh, what Matthew ta taught me, and like, it's very hard to. To like get to change any behavior, excluding that, but no! Jesus Christ, Kane, stop doing that. They've been teaching us wrong our entire lives, the golden rule. Uh, like uh, treat others the way you want to you'd like to be treated yourself. That is wrong, because that's very egoistic if you think about it. Treat others the way they'd like to be treated. Because if I treat everybody the way Oh there we go, checkpoint, perfect, perfect. We made it! Another checkpoint before ending the session while doing all the philosophical talks. Um, not much. I used this tram and all that. Subway. Killed a lot of guys. They blew up the distillery of magical fart so magic. Much, eh? yeah. <laughs> Nothing really worth. 40%. Okay. okay, we moved. But yeah, I want to close with that. Like the thing that that that's a very powerful thing to think about that uh, if I treated everybody the way I want to be treated that, that means the old people would have to be the same as me right and they still teach that to kids in school like treat others the way you you want to be treated no yeah because that, that meant that uh, you should be kind because you want others to be kind to you but yeah but all again different from everyone's perspective yeah perspective is very important but enough of like enough of them. <laughs> we went to a different i'm glad we touched on this but we should raid someone it's been a very good session way more progress than than yesterday i don't know what happened maybe the game just picked up space maybe it was me maybe it was all the good viewers i had there but just Aww. uh just we got to do a raid you got to do a raid when you got to do a raid why am i doing this voice i just feel very good when i feel very good i do voices just fucking deal with it okay channels you follow should be dooby doo <gasps> dreamy magenta sheep is doing kingdom hearts recoded let's let's raid her star raid here we go 
she's still doing Kingdom Hearts. I thought she was doing that a month ago. Those are huge games, though, so... No, I get that. I treat people the nicest I can. It's hard for me. <laughs> but they see that and they take advantage of it, so I won't bend over because of them. It's a it's a long topic. We'll touch on it again, I'm sure. I'm trying to spread all the knowledge that Matthew gives to me because, well, that's what he wants. He's always like, whatever I teach you and what he, to our clients, he also says, whatever I teach you, I don't expect you to hug this like a like a family secret, be like, ha, ah, mine, all oh, mine, but spread it, you know. He says, learn it, live it, lend it. So learn it for yourself, live it, apply it to your life, and then lend it. Show it to other people. Yes, it sounds like we'll get like we'll be out of job soon, but no, there's too many people, too too much on the world. So yeah, so that's it for me for tonight. Thank you, thank you, John. Thank you, Zombie Sister Lupka, Sister Nirvanitsa. If she's somewhere around here, just lurking. Everybody who was watching, Carter made went to make food, and maybe the food made him. All the new people, Morshi. Kalakua, Dr. Baby, everybody. <laughs> Good night. See you soon. Say hi to Dreamy for me. And uh, I'll see you tomorrow early morning with Sea of Thieves. Bye-bye.